Here's an easy target with just one quiet pop. Shot to hell anyway, no reason to stop. In the streets and the gutters and the cotton fields of this land. We're just easy targets with pistols in our hands. Let's start with uh, Easy Target. Right. We'll talk about the song. What inspired you specifically? I've been writing about uh, race relationships in this country since the beginning of my career. Originally, when I wrote a song called Jack and Diane, Jack was black mm -hmm. in the song, but I ended up changing it at the end. So it's something that, uh, you know, I grew up singing in a soul band mm -hmm. with half the guys white and half the guys uh, African-American and this was in the 60s it taught me very early you know it was like wow black people really do have a different life here in America than I do. So black lives matter who we trying to kid they're just easy targets never mattered never did cross is burning such a long time ago 400 years, and we still won't let it go. So let the poor be damned, and the easy targets too. We're all created equal, equally beneath me and you. What inspired you? to really get involved and help launch Farm Aid? Uh, well, Farm Aid was, uh, you know, like anything else, was a total, uh, my introduction uh, to Willie was a total, you know, accident. A friend of mine actually was playing golf with Willie. Mm -hmm. He said, have you heard Mellencamp's new record? And he said, no. And he goes, it's about the uh, uh, small American farmer and there's a bunch of songs on there about that. And I mean, within five minutes, I, my, I answer the phone is like, Hey, it's Willie Nelson, you want to help me do Farm Aid? And then uh, like a day later, I got a call from Neil Young. He said, so I guess we're doing this Farm Aid. <laughs> and are you surprised it's still going strong? No, uh, I, I hate that it's still going strong mm -hmm. uh, because, you know, we were so naive at the time, Joe, mm -hmm. that uh, we thought, well, we'll do this concert and uh, it'll bring attention to it. And uh, the government will go, wow, we really do, you know, it's the farmer feeds the people and, you know, people want good, clean food and and they'll see, you know, uh, mm -hmm. the error in their lawmaking ways. Children crying under the time keep it on. This war on easy targets looks like we just begun. A lot of your fans right. are people who, in 2008, voted for Barack Obama mm -hmm. and even turned Indiana blue. In 2016, they voted for Donald Trump. Mm -hmm. Does it concern you, or how did that happen? Well, for one thing, I trust no politicians, none. Democrat, Republican, Independent, they all have an agenda. And we don't know what that agenda is. Of course, we also know that the agenda is to get reelected. Mm -hmm. It seems to me to be wrong. But have you great, you've gotten more concerned, though, haven't you, over the past six, eight months by what you've seen? No. Really? So this is not, no, this uh, is not a, as much of a shock to you as it is to other people? Uh, oh, it's a shock. So are you going to stay involved, though, politically? Do you, do you still feel like it's worth the fight? Have you given up? Oh, I think that, no, I'm, no, you never give up. Easy targets all along the avenue. Living here in sucker town, just me and you. Behind the bars, the 
keep us apart Easy targets This country's broken heart Our country's broken heart Got it? Anything else you need?